Okay, today we are gonna be making a hot cocoa ornament. Here is the wood cutout I found at the Dollar Tree. I went ahead and designed a um, image that would fit perfectly within this ornament. And so, um, first we're gonna start out, I'm gonna show you everything that you need for this project. You're gonna need some paint, however, whatever colors you wanna use for this project. I figured I would paint the cup red and then the uh, whipped cream area a cream color. Uh, I might add some white to that to make it lighter. Um, the ornament does come with string. I think you get like a pack of six maybe or eight with this. I already had this cute little bow that I'm uh, want to add to it when it's done, which we will need a glue gun for that, a hot glue gun. Um, you're gonna need scissors and your weeding tool. You're gonna want to cut out your image out of whatever kind of vinyl you would like to use. I used a matte black for this one. Transfer tape and your um, scraper tool. First thing I'm gonna to wanna to do is weed my design. So I'm gonna do that now. Yay, nice and easy, came right off. Woohoo! Okay, and here is the design. It says Christmas movies and hot cocoa. I thought that was perfect for this ornament shape. Okay, now um, I can set that aside or add the transfer tape later. I'm gonna set that aside and I'm gonna paint my ornament. Just gonna do a little mark where I think the whipped cream would start on this mug. The design was um, created with the whipped cream in mind. So your image should go below the whipped cream, should not cover up that area at all. So you might wanna measure out you could be more precise with this, measure out where exactly your design will fit on this mug. I thought this um, ornament would be super cute um, if you're gifting something to a friend for Christmas or the holidays. Uh, you could even make a gift basket with um, a like a movie night theme, Christmas movies, and you can add a hot chocolate packets to a basket or, you know, marshmallows and all the good toppings or whipped cream. And, um, and then this could be a tag on the basket and it says Christmas movies and hot cocoa. And then they can use this as an ornament on their tree afterwards. It'd be cute, even add some like sprinkles on top of this. Just thought of that, so I didn't bring any colors for that, but you could do like some brown sprinkles or even red or green. Green sprinkle sprinkles would be cute. I'm gonna do one more coat of each color just so it's nice and solid. All right, now that I've got that painted, I did the back as well. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put transfer tape on my decal. It's on there. Take it away from the backing paper. And Put it on my mug. Okay, and press down with my finger. I'm 
and use my little scraper tool to get some more pressure on there. Push it all down. And now we remove the back or the transfer tape, excuse me. Okay, now our design is on there. It fits perfectly. Here's your twine that comes with the ornament. You can choose to use your own string if you want to add some festive colorful string or if you want to just use this or whatever you'd like to do. This is what comes with it. So that's what I'm going to use. Thread it through the hole and I'm just going to tie a knot at the top. Just like that. And now I want to add this cute little bow I have. Figured it matches really well. Let's see, where should we put it? Over here, or maybe over here. I'm thinking maybe this side. Okay, now I'm just gonna use my hot glue gun to glue on this bow. Just one little dab is all you need. Oops. And there you have it. Super simple, fast project, but that's cute and people can use year after year on their Christmas tree.